Kate Martin now getting it down low to Stolke early. She's fouled and won. Looking to get three points the old-fashioned way early in this one. Clark pushing the pace. You know Iowa loves to play fast. Gets into the paint, the lefty lay, and it's in. Iowa, seven points quickly in this one. Resetting here, looking to get it to Stolke down low, and she does. Stolke's gonna kick it out to Clark from deep. Knocks it down, Caitlin Clark with her first triple of the season. Molly Davis has checked in for Iowa. Checks in for Goodman, deep three from Clark, and one! She just makes it look easy out there. As that is a rebound there by Molly Davis. And you know, we're already seeing that Goodman and her as Clark shoots it and makes another one, splashes that one. 10 seconds to go here in the first quarter. Iowa sends a quick double. And they are hounding the night. A Folter knocks it loose. Davis gets it, flips it up, and <laughs> flips it in. What a play there what? from the Hawkeyes. Into the paint, looking to create. Stokey's got a mismatch. But Clark will shoot the fade away and knock it down. Clark gets it to Stokey. Stokey, crossover work there, hop, step, bucket. A little smile as she walked away. Dribble handoff there to Stolke. Stolke, the right drive. Spins to her left and gets the bucket to fall. She's got nine points and seven rebounds right now. They have eight points off of second chance also. So they've been capitalizing. Stolke is going to kick it out. A Fulter for three. Splash! Here in the second half now, you're listening to Michael Merrick alongside Vivian Samoski here in Carver Hawkeye Arena. Stokey wastes no time in the second half, getting a bucket less than 10 seconds into it. A real shifty guard who is a great playmaker. Ball fake there from Conklin. She's gonna kick it out to Parkey. She shoots oh. the three and splashes it. What they can apply for this next half. I'm really excited to see what FDU can apply. But you know, this it's still game time, obviously. It's, 62, 27, adding it on right there. Bucket there from the Knights. Stolke has a little bit of positioning down low. Clark, though, the open three, splashes it home. It Can't leave her open. Oh, drops a dime there to Stolke. Gets it to Goodman, back to Clark. Getting into the paint. Scoop pass to Goodman, and she scores again. Clark's looking for the ball. She gets it into the paint. High pass to O'Grady, skips it to the corner. A Fulter drives in, contact, and one. And one. Molly Davis gets the rebound. We've talked about <laughs> the look at the smile on her face. Clark dishes it down low. Oh, Grady gets her own and one. Let's go to the line once again. But it gives FDU an opportunity to get a basket in right now, probably from the three because they've been shooting a little bit from the top of the key. But also, oh, there's one right there. They're gonna get, and, it, and it's good. And it's good. Give it, give it to him. Yeah, and FDU is in a matchup zone here. Gimphy at the top of the key Good gets luck. it to Goodman. Goodman, another and bucket and one. And that's what I'm talking about. Goodman using the play, looking high low. One for one from the line. She just knocked it down. Got three points the old-fashioned way. Iowa going with a trapping zone now. Three-pointer there. Parkey knocks it down. She is a stretch forward. But down low now to Goodman. Gets it to Clark. Clark's going to kick it out. Stokey's going to shoot it. It's yeah! flash it. Stokey from three. Clark now pushing it. Only two assists and three rebounds shy of the triple double. Now one assist shy. You know, I said she might not get it. She is. She Jeez. must have heard me. Yeah, definitely does. Only has two turnovers in this game, and those were both in the first. Well, make it three. <laughs> Kolar gets the steal in the bucket. She has nine assists, seven rebounds, and it, it, it's possible. It's possible. You know, it feels, oh, Stolke gets it right there. She's at least got the double-double. Clark gets her 10th assist of the game. Five minutes to go. You know, I don't want to get ahead of myself in saying it'll be a Hawkeye win as it's a nice bucket there from Toomey. Get right back up, right down the court once again. And you'll probably see her get a rebound too while she's at it. Definitely will. Fearbot gets it down low to Gimphy. Gimphy up and in. Five on the clock now. Shots up, no good. And that'll do it here in Carver Hawkeye Arena, Iowa. 1-0 on the year. And what a game it was for the Hawkeyes, 102-46.